Now, cholesterol is very important for your health. The liver uses cholesterol to fix inflammation that you're causing your system through seed oils, wheat products, and sugar, sodas, and those processed and ultra-processed foods. So don't blame cholesterol for what those three foods are did to you. Now listen to this. This is the question of the day. When I am not eating cholesterol-rich foods, the eggs, the fish, the fatty meats, do I need a statin? If you answer that question, if you see what I'm asking, you will understand how the system is designed. Now listen, they tell you not to eat the eggs, they tell you not to eat the fatty meats, they tell you to drop the saturated fats because they will clog your arteries with cholesterol. But when you stop these foods, your cholesterol levels are still up. Why? Because the liver still makes cholesterol. And why would the liver make a substance that will hurt you? Start asking those questions. So you told me to drop these foods that are rich in cholesterol, but my cholesterol levels are still misbehaving. Therefore, that's the time you find the need to give me a statin to actually lower the misbehaving cholesterol. Why are you giving me a statin to stop the liver from making cholesterol? The liver cannot make something that will kill me. So this is the point. I expect when you tell me to drop the, the, the cholesterol-rich diets, my cholesterol levels will go back to normal, right? But why is it that I've stopped eating them, but I still have high cholesterol in the system, and now you have to give me a statin? You either choose to give me a statin as I eat my cholesterol-rich foods, because the statin will control cholesterol, or you tell me to stop eating the cholesterol-rich foods, and my system normalizes. But now that's not what is happening. You, you're told to stop eating cholesterol-rich foods, and then they have to supplement with a statin. Start asking that doctor those questions.